Oh, this looks like a good spot. Okay, let's do this. Okay, now kids, put on your sunscreen. Put on your sunscreen. Okay. Here we are. <laughs> Today we are trying on some sexy swimwear. We have collected some of the most bizarre. Oh, look, there's a pool. Raunchy. Ooh, right up the butt. And honestly, just weird swimsuits. Hey, you guys wanna go tanning? We're gonna put them on our bodies? Feel good about it. Oh gosh, I left your goggles in the Hampton Inn. Okay, I'll go back. <laughs> ah, oh God. Look, this year, you're not going to the beach. I am a little high. I have uh, severe insomnia, and I took a nap before this, and I thought I took these melatonin gummies, but I think they were weed gummies, so. Oh my God. Wait, wait, what if it's like a little person? Oh yeah. I've always said we don't get enough high Eugene because Zach and Keith always want to be high and then I have to get drunk and I'm kind of over, I'm kind of over that. Honestly, I'm a little over it. Oh man, his name's Grape. Grape says a little too much to drink. Because <laughs> being drunk makes you sad. And the world is sad. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> Hello. Um, <laughs> I forgot it was there. I call it a bathing suit, but you don't bathe in it. Oh, fuck. yeah. Oh, it's a sloth. This one is appropriately tasteful, ironic comedy in a swimsuit. A sloth riding a T-Rex shooting lasers out of his eyes? Who is she? Because I'm taking her home. All it really needs is a couple of cats flying in the air. Do I look like a wrestler? A little bit. It is a little bit of a unitard wrestler look. Like, if I was a stoner wrestler character. And it says, like, I'm at the pool, but I'm just here to have fun. When I come out on the screen, oh, my name would just be 420. This is historically inaccurate. These, like, unitards are popular, like, female apparel, right? Where they just basically wear this. You can see me in a Walmart in this, right? What if I'm just, like, waiting in the 7-Eleven behind you? You know, that kind of cool doily style. Very grandma's doily. My, my toe, shoot, my toes got stuck in the crochet. Come on, Keith, fit in the thing that Zach fit into. Focus, balance, balance. You know in Forrest Gump, when Jenny becomes like a hippie and starts doing drugs, I feel like this is what she would have worn. I gotta get it up to my belly button. You can put um, cups on me, because I'm a doily. You know what I need? I need a big hat. I need like a giant hat for this one. I feel like my <laughs> stomach is wearing a glove. Like a fingerless glove. I don't think we're gonna go to Coachella this year because of like coronavirus or whatever, but. Okay, guys, guys, I look great. <laughs> I look so good. And look at this, I can shimmy. I mean, these are what I used to have on my front room table to protect the nice wood, and I left my Tamagotchi on it. Why a hole for my belly button? This is not something that I'm trying to accent. Do we still give Audis to people, or was that a mistake that we, we cleared up in the 90s? Let me tell you this. You can have a pool party at your house, get in your bathtub, pop a bottle of wine, watch Grey's Anatomy like Miles. I would say I've gotten into bathtubs with my girlfriends far more than my boyfriend's husband. Oh, and with your daughters. Do you ever just look at them and think, wow, I am a god? I am a god, but mm -hmm. it's a wow. That's why women are gods. Your conception of god doesn't compare, because has god actually made a baby in front of you? No. Oh yeah, sexy red little number. A lot of little ringlets. This is a nice one piece, but it's, oh, oh no. <laughs> Each of these loops is catching my dick, oh. right? Yeah, it kind of does look like I have little boobs. I mean, I do have little boobs, a little bit. Tanline would make me look like I have a 20 pack. Ow, 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 ow. So what you're saying is it doubles as a strapless swimsuit? I'd wear this to a sonic convention so that you can collect all these rings. This is cute though, how about this? Could you imagine me taking a cute Instagram photo at Palm Springs? Sonic the Hedgehog. Have you not watched the movie movie? It's mainly because I really like Jim Carrey and I really, really like James Marsden but for very different reasons. I feel like I look like Iron Man right now. Be like, right? Like I look like a f***able Iron Man. But it's not about this anymore on Instagram. It's all about the butt. I will say what's going on with this little guy. I've got a tiny boner at my belly button. 
Hi guys, my name's Deborah, but I go by Deborah. It's over there. And then there's also the... Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> right, though? You know what I'm talking about! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look, there's a pool. <laughs> ah, oh, God. Fill me up with water. Everybody only takes pictures of, like, them being like, oh, my ass. Boop. Boop. This is how I like to enjoy myself. I can clap with my little lobster feet. I'm very talented. Ooh! Cut to Zach saying, huh? No, 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 no. This is marketed towards women? I don't think that this is enough to cover up a vagina. Well, this is just really splitting the beans. Some people have vaginas that are bigger than this. This one's much more appropriate to be a face mask. I feel like, again, the tan lines would be just kind of all over the place here. Yeah, right? I don't even think we could have bigger boobs. Yeah, Miles, I know I need bigger boobs. I'm a little bigger chested than Zach, so I'm hoping I can fill a little bit of this out without the mugs. Check out my mugs. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh, I love the tea. Get your tea now at zadico.com. <laughs> oh, I got like saliva on it from when it was on my face. Gross! Bam! Bam! This feels kind of like I'm also a cartoon character. What her name be? Bubblegum. Best friends with Grape. Miles, can you provide the voice for Grape? Hey, how's it going, everybody? Hey, pretty good, Grape. How are you doing? Doing all right, Eugene. You hear the joke about how wine's made, Grape? How is wine made? They, they crush you and your family. Oh, no. This one's just in poor taste. Oh, Jesus. This one is... Oh boy. Oh, you made Zach's body into a swimsuit? My time to shine. What do you call that? The lower back patch of hair some men have. Oh my God, look how horrifying it is as it slides up my body. Is it like a tramp stamp? Yeah, it's literally like a hair tramp stamp. The crack, crack, track. Crack, track. It kind of looks like an octopus against the ocean floor. It looks just like Zach. Ew. Ew! Ew! Well, Zach has bigger nipples though. Ew, these nipples are very dark and shiny. Oh, don't put that in there. He'll be so self-conscious. Also, are these nipples? They look like owl eyes. Strong padding. I mean, look at my little boobies. You know, I'm a little disappointed in the quality. I don't know what it looks like on camera, but this is pixelated chest hair. Really low resolution. So this is supposed to be a man's body created for a woman to wear. Ah, uh, but there's no dick. Terrible quality. I think that my chest is better looking than this one. <laughs> hey, if you're gonna wear this, and your goal is to make people feel uncomfortable, you gotta lean in, baby. Oh, me? I'm having a ball. You gotta be the person who's like laying like this, and then like as people walk by, you go. Ah! Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Let's just get gross. Oh my god, this is horrible. You wear this to be upsetting. You just this is only this is only to be upset. Meow, meow, meow. Ooh, I already like this one a lot. Nobody wants to be reminded of their intestines. What's sexier than revealing everything on your body? Revealing everything in your body. First of all, one thing I love about it is that it's got sleeves. And there's just something so funny to a swimsuit with sleeves. I would wear this to a science class. Picture this, a magic bus. <laughs> I've been feeling a little gassy today. You can see why. And I come in, also I have very frizzy red hair. And I'm like, hello students. They say, oh, we're gonna learn about the human anatomy. I say, yeah, get on, 
the bus. We're going inside someone's body. This is, I feel like, a great f you to any, like, if you got a really banging bod, but you're sick and tired of dudes checking you out, put this thing on. Hello! Uh, I'm this person in your friend group. You know what also is upsetting is that this is someone's king. Someone's watching this and is like, oh, finally, he looks hot. I wish I was a little wet. You know? Hold on. So you have the drips. Because <laughs> I'm just so wet. Doing your ass warm? I got all wet. Flip! Ooh, naughty. Great. I'm wearing a hat. Uh, <laughs> great. <laughs> You're crazy. He kind of looked like, um, what's his name in Jurassic Park, who seals the DNA and then he gets eaten by the Dilophosaurus, from, also from Seinfeld. We've seen a lot of skimpy stuff today. I need something, I need a one piece. You know, I need something I feel comfortable in. Okay, this is not what I had in mind. Oh yeah, slingshot! I thought the other one was silly string. What the hell even is this? I like the simplicity of this. They wouldn't even wear this in Brazil. Would they? Is this like the female version of the Borat? I think it is. Oh, wow. Would you like some candy? <laughs> My wife. <laughs> I've seen one of these before in the store. What do you do? What store? The store. So you have this, and then you take water balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Ow. Really far up the butt. This one's the most, most, um, have you seen The Descent? Great movie. It's the most like that, except an ascent. There's no way for my dick to look okay. I feel like it is doing things for my butt though. Is it doing too many things? My kid is gonna see this one day. because I've got to like shoot it from I need hold on <laughs> oh yeah guys this this is this is fun oh. Rachel would you wear any of these swimsuits we tried on Absolutely not. What about the one with the sloth riding on top of the T-Rex? That's the closest. Is it supposed to connect? Is this supposed to hook up? Is this if I'm like misbehaving? It's like, come on, son, hurry up. <laughs> Dad, I want to go on the water slide. Shut up. There's got to be something to this. Grape, can you figure this out? No. Oh, Grape, you've had too much to drink. We are not going out anymore, Drake. Who's Drake? <laughs> I thought no, I called you Drake. I thought your name was Grape. Does it make my booty look good? Does it make my butt look good? I've been tied up by that brutish pirate. Ugh. Again, crazy nightmare of tan lines. This is funny. It feels like uh, I'm a drawing on the floor with which you could cast spells in. Right? If I was like on the floor, could you see me surrounded in candles and like a bunch of 16-year-old girls? who were like, oh, I believe, I know, no magic's real. No, I was at a party once and like, we used a Ouija board and there was a ghost named Gurf. And Gurf was like, he kept answering no. Hey, Grape. Yeah, you see? Didn't want to bring this up here, but your wife's really worried about you. I know. Sexy lady bathing suits, I really feel like you're putting yourself out on display in a way that men seldom do. She, uh, she thinks you're parting too hard with the, uh, the oranges. I feel like meat has been strung up and left to dry. But I learned from the best, you see. Hey, hey, hey. I haven't talked to the oranges since 1945. All these suits really appeal to different body types, right? Or different confidence levels. Mostly I think whatever you want to wear is fine. As long as you're legally covering the things you need to legally cover, that's probably all that matters. Right? Fashion. Well, this was another wonderful episode of the Magic School Bus. I'm Mrs. Frizzle. Tune in next week when I teach Grape all about space. And what do you do in space? You ride a T-Rex. Good night, Philippines.
Is the booty hairy? Oh, yeah. Oh. What does it look like? I can't see it. Is it cute? No. no. I think it's hairier than my real booty.